Let me give two examples of where holistic care might take us that are often not a standard part of our treatment. And they're, they're two subjects that are often ignored in mental health. And they're two aspects of life that are fundamentally important to loads of people. And one is love and one is spirituality. And we often think those two subjects have no place in mental health, but they certainly have a place in terms of the holistic aspect of our lives. And they're also two areas that are often impacted by mental health. So being able to talk with people about their experience of love and significant relationships, even being able to talk with people about um, their sexual health and their, their lives and wishes around sexuality are really important. We also know that many people's experiences around psychosis are linked with spiritual beliefs and even the experience of hearing spiritual voices like angels or demons. And so many people find it really helpful to get some spiritual guidance around their experiences and not just to frame it as a, a symptom or a problem or something to be eliminated. And it can be deeply valuable for people to find supports in their communities that help them explore those experiences.